All right, uh, what do we have here? Uh, first, subscribe to the channel and share the video, right? <coughs> this is 2011 RAV4 2.5 liter engine. Here is the history, and this is really important. Uh, three years ago, today is October 18th, 2024. So four years ago or three years ago, I did, the car had 170,000 miles on it. And I did, the car right now has a 200,000. So I did, <clears throat> maybe it was 160 or 150, but in that range. Uh, so three years ago, I did a flush. The reason was the, the fluid was a little bit dark in the, when I used the stick, like wipe the stick in a, napkins and it was dark <clears throat> so I did a flush not a, just a drain and refill and car was doing really well all right till July of this year 2024 I was traveling far from home around one uh, 700 miles away and the car all of the sudden not shifting at all like doesn't shift to any gear not in the first gear second gear third fourth uh, reverse nothing it's always exactly like uh, you have the car in neutral doesn't shift doesn't move then what i did i i uh, towed the car to my house but anyway i did drain and refill i changed the strainer I but I dropped the valve body thinking there was something wrong with it in the passages everything got, I got everything clean I have a video that is like 25 minutes video then everything was good then I started the car was working for just one month and a half maybe two months less than two months then it did it again not shifting at all so today, I'm not gonna just drain and refill. I'm gonna do a flush. Because back in July, when I did the, the drain or refill, it was so dirty with lots of uh, fine powders in the, in, the, in the shift. So today we're gonna do drain uh, uh, and flush. What I'm gonna do, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do first here is my, my strategy. Let me get out of the car. So first, I'm gonna drain, drain the fluid. Then I will use, disconnect the return hose, drain the fluid, maybe drop the pan, get the filter cleaned without replacing. Okay, hold on. Get the filter clean without replacing uh, clean the pan and everything then I start to do my flush disconnect the return hose then after this we're gonna after I completely finish the flush I'm gonna drop the pan again clean it and change replace the strainer then everything now should be really clean let's go